Okay, I'll tell you this. I was a striker when I began. No, I just remember. I have one image in my head that I'll, I'll never forget it. It was me, my dad, and my brother. Very top memories, yeah. Uh, with my with my dad and my brother, also my mother sometimes, but especially us three, we would watch every kind of game. It's it was definitely one of the biggest learning points I had. It was my open book uh, to to go and watch one or two games every week because at the end of it all, uh, you need to dream it before you achieve it. When I was younger, I used to play for Arden Den Haag, so that's my my town where I was born. We always got tickets for for to to watch the first team play. Um, so yeah, it was always a great experience. We always with the family and with teammates, and yeah, we were like nine or eight or something like that. First game was PSG against Strasbourg. It was me, my dad, and my brother, and we took the bus and the train, and you know, I could, you could see the people going to the game. And no, I just remember. I have one image in my head that I'll, I'll never forget it when. I think I was watching training or watching a game for my brother, and um, they they just because I was always there. They just said, "Come, come and join us," and I just have this image. I, I don't even remember the game or nothing, but just looking looking up to players, and because everyone was so tall and so big, and I was so small, so the only thing I see in my head is like shirts and boots and stuff like that. I have like a, you know a municipal like stadium. Everyone can go and play. I used to go with my dad, and he used to train me. That was, very top memories, yeah. Okay, I'll tell you this. I was a striker when I began. Really striker, like scoring goals was all I did. And the uh, first game I've ever played, like a uh, competitive game, like official, like, I don't know, 10 minutes in the game, and I was in the back because I couldn't help myself. <laughs> I was seeing the team suffering and suffering and I was like, okay, but I need to stay here because it's my position. Uh, and soon enough, I just went to the back and I never came out again. Yeah, it was a tough match. Uh, it was um, on Boxing Day, uh, Chelsea against Norwich. Um, and it was like the last, what, three minutes or so and we were 1-0 up. Yeah, it was, to be fair, it was quite nerve-wracking when I, when I heard my name. But once you're on, on the pitch, then it becomes quite, quite normal again. Uh, it was a game with love against Angers. And I came on 10 minutes. To be fair, I was so excited to be on the bench. And then uh, when the, the manager called me and said, come on, I was running everywhere, you know. It was like very, very uh, emotional, yeah. It was definitely special. It was something I was looking for for a long uh, before I, I did it. And uh, it's something I'm, I'm very looking forward to add on. I was away against Cardiff. The first goal is always, was always different, you know, it feels like a, a different emotion, you're like, you're very happy. And I scored two this game as well, so it was good. Uh, I was in Switzerland, we played against Armenia. It was very emotional, yeah, more than, man, more than a club, you know. Uh, when you play for your country, when you hear the national anthem. I actually walked on the pitch with the, with the national team um, when I was younger, you know, as a, what's it called, a, yeah, mascot and stuff like that. And to, and then after to be able to to play with them myself after is, yeah, I think is a great great thing as well. I used to love like Drogba, Eberi. I never met them when I when I was uh, young, when I was a teenager, but and I met them when I made I made I made in football in the Premier League and stuff, and I always tell them now. Uh, well, I used to be fan of you and then <laughs> they're laughing and stuff, but it's good, you know. <laughs>